All right, switching gears now, uh, that forecast, another big story for the day. The rain has been uh, a big part of the day for a lot of folks. Yeah, it's been kind of off and on and starting out light, but it's going to get heavier and the wind is going to pick up as we go through the day. So that's the reason why we are under a microclimate weather alert. As we head into our Friday evening, we will start to see the weather kind of going downhill. As of now, it's not too bad. We're seeing a lot of clouds, some every now and then some light rain coming down and a light breezy wind, but still the main part of this storm is off the coast and will continue to make its progress across the Bay Area going into this afternoon. As we get a closer look with Storm Ranger, our mobile Doppler radar, seeing some light green here in parts of the North Bay along the coastline and every now and then we've also seen it moving through parts of the South Bay. Looking at about two to three o'clock this afternoon, that's when we start to see it really lighting up here. And that's when the most intense cells will be moving through parts of the North Bay and gusty winds as well. At 430, it's coming into Half Moon Bay and Oakland and some of the lighter rain out ahead of that moving into parts of the East Bay. But even as we go through that evening commute, as it continues to move through San Jose and Danville all the way up to Fairfield at eight to nine o'clock tonight, still some really heavy rain will continue and I wouldn't be surprised if we had some thunderstorms as we're also looking at some high wind gusts to pick up for the evening. But as we go into tomorrow morning into the afternoon, the rain is clearing out. So the good thing is that it's not going to linger for a really long time. And we're even during that short period of time going to see some significant rainfall totals in parts of the North Bay. We're expecting at least an inch and a half of rainfall. San Francisco getting an inch of rain and rainfall coming this this fast up to an inch, an inch and a half could clog some of those storm drains and may cause some issues. So we're watching, especially Napa and Sonoma counties, where the rainfall totals will be higher. Watching those creeks, rivers and streams, they may reach the monitor stage. And so you do want to watch some of those areas that do typically flood in heavy rain events. Moving ahead, we are going to see a couple of more storm systems coming in. The next one will be arriving for the middle of next week, and we're hoping for more snow because the Sierra snow has been so low and models are now picking up on that that through next week we could possibly see two feet of snow in the Sierra as the colder air comes in here in the Bay Area of course we'll be watching the rain coming in this evening spotty showers in the forecast through the rest of the weekend